a rough night last night. Actually, a very rough night. I had vertigo. Have you ever had vertigo? That is unpleasant on a level of, I don't even know. I turned over to get a drink of water and all of a sudden I was spinning like I cannot even tell you. Let me sit down here with you guys. I have to sit on my floor because I'm always, I'm constantly trying to get the right thing. Um, anyway, tripod. Only had a half a cup of coffee. Um, yeah, I turned over to get a drink of water and I just flipping backwards. If you've ever had that, you know what I'm talking about. It's awful. So I slept later than I normally would. At about 8.15, Kevin came in and was purposely making noise like he brought me a coffee like this, kind of trying to wake me up. So I got up and I realized I still have it. I just did the exercise series and it's a little bit better. I can tell it's my right ear, but oh my gosh, ugh, I can't stand it. And I really don't want to deal with that today. So I hope it goes away. I hope it gets better. I'll do that exercise three times a day. I think you're supposed to do it. Anyway, um, last night I went through a lot of my um, food journals. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm getting it together. I promise. I went through my um, food journals and you know what I'm going to do? Tell me if you want me to do this. I think this would be really interesting. I am printing out all of those, those screenshots that I'm giving you at the end of the video going over all my food. I am going to sit down and calculate what the points would have been on those foods. I'm just curious. I'm just curious. And, you know, I was talking to another YouTuber last night about this, and she is a WW YouTuber. And she kind of, we were talking about how so many people have to tweak the program in some kind of way to make it work for them. And then we all get these, like, um, I don't know, justifications. Well, that's why you call it my WW. Well, that's why you call it my personal points because you're changing the plan. Now, I know I'm being a little spicy this morning, but I was thinking about that. And I just think in what all, you know, everyone in the world, everybody's going through right now with inflation and with prices being so high and so many people struggling, that extra 20 or as much sometimes as $40 a month, and then you have to sort of recreate your own plan and retake the quiz they give you four and five times. I just, that's a, I'm frustrated with it, which is again, why I'm trying to get myself educated and program proof my program. Anyway, I'm going to hope that this vertigo gets better. Drink the rest of my coffee and I will see you at my first day. And I am hungry, hungry, hungry. So let me show you what I just whipped up. I did two eggs and then a quarter cup of egg whites. So that we've got a lot of eggs there. <laughs> And then I added a little squirt, about a teaspoon, not a tablespoon. A tablespoon is 80 calories. What do we have there? Let's zoom that in. And zero carbs. I did about a teaspoon, if that, of this truffle aioli for some flavor. And then I did two measured tablespoons of the fancy shredded light Mexican cheese from Trader Joe's. I am so hungry. All right, I'm going to eat. The Marco Island beaches did not take a really hard hit from the hurricane, so I came out here to Tiger Tail Beach, and I decided to do a little walking for exercise. This is a beautiful beach. It's very, very natural. So I'm walking up to what is sort of like the lagoon, and then if you want to go to the Gulf of Mexico, to the actual beach part of it, then you cross the lagoon. You actually, I'm going to have to wade across all that water. But on the other side, it's like you stepped into this big paradise. See, if you went up those stairs, you could see it just out beyond that tree line. But it's absolutely beautiful. I, I really, really enjoy it because you get, you don't feel like you're exercising, but you're kind of like doing a lot between walking through the sand and then crossing the water and then coming back. It's just absolutely beautiful. Okay, I am home. That was so much fun. So I'm going to have this zero sugar light and fake yogurt. Big burst of protein, 11 grams, 50 calories. But I know I'm going to want a little something else. So I'm also going to have two tablespoons of these honey roasted pistachios. A little bit of healthy fat really helps fill me up before dinner. So that should do it for lunch for me. 
and then we will be on to dinner tonight. So Kevin was nice enough to brown this up for me with a little bit of onion in it. How much garlic did you put in? Uh, about one of these. About one teaspoon? Yeah. That's it. See, I put a lot more garlic in than that. And then salt and pepper, right? Yep. Okay. And now we're going to put taco seasoning in. All right. I'm ready. Don't we win. We strained this hamburger to blood stuff there. I'm going to guess that to be probably two tablespoons. You want to put a tiny bit of water in there? Like maybe a quarter cup? Okay. I'll grab it. All right, that's about a half a cup. I'm going to hand that to you. Now let's see how that does. Okay. <laughs> that was a half a cup. All right, that looks perfect. So we'll just kind of let that simmer a little bit. And we're going to make taco salad, street taco, whatever you want. You can do, what are you going to do, Kevin? You could do nachos. Yeah, you do nachos for sure. I'm not going to do nachos. I might just do the taco meat with a bed of lettuce, cheese, sour cream, and hot sauce. That sounds really good. You don't need to cook it anymore. Okay, let me put the lid on and we're done. All right, perfect.